In this tutorial, I will show you how to deal with outliers in Origin. I will mask an outlier so it will be excluded in the analysis. I've already imported a sample file, so let's create a simple scatter plot of the data. Now, open the Fit Linear tool from the Analysis menu. Change the Recalculate mode to be Auto so that when the source data changes, the linear fit can be automatically carried out to get updated results. By default, this tool will paste result tables into the source graph. I don't need this, so I will disable it. Let's see the results in the report sheet. Note that the adjusted R-square value is about 0.6, this indicates that the fitting is not very good. We'll save this fit curve into another book and plot it back later for comparison. Open a new workbook. Now go to the graph and select the fit line. Use Control C to copy it, then Control V to paste it into the empty workbook. Now look at the graph again. There's a point near the bottom axis likely to be a faulty point or an outlier. We can exclude it from the fitting by masking it. To mask it, use the Regional Mask tool. Click and hold down the left mouse button to open the flyout menu. The Add and Remove Mask Points in the Active Plot will only mask or unmask points in the Active Curve. The Add and Remove Mask Points in All Plots will mask or unmask points in all curves in the Active Layer. Click on the Add Mass Points to Active Plot. Then draw a rectangle around the point. Auto Update is performed, and the linear fit was carried out again, but this time the mass point was not included. Now go to the Report Sheet. The adjusted R-square value is now 0.9. This is a much better fit. Now, I'll plot the old fitted curve into the graph. Go to the workbook where you backed up the original data and select it and then drag and drop it onto the graph. I want to point out that the masked data point is also masked in the source worksheet. Here, the data set that corresponds with the masked data point is in red. You can remove the mask at any time you want in the worksheet or in the graph. On the graph, just use the Remove Mask Point tool. You can use the spacebar to toggle the shape of the tool. Or you can use Tab to change mode between Active Plot and All Plots. Click and drag around the mask point to select the region. The auto update is carried out again. The fitting line reverts back to the original. You can also use the mask tool to repeatedly select different data points. This concludes the tutorial. Thank you for watching.